YouTube family. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I posted on Instagram and Facebook to vote if you wanted to see a fall haul. And all of you said yes. So, I was anticipating that. But I'm going to go ahead and show it to you because I think you're going to love it. I went to Hobby Lobby um, about a month ago. And they had sold out of a lot of the stuff that I was really wanting. So, I just waited and I thought, I'm not going to, you know, buy anything today. I'm just going to wait, see what happens. Because I was going between a couple different things. I was going between a, a couple different things. And I thought, well, um, I was really wanting to do the sunflowers. And you all know I do a lot of Dollar, Dollar Tree stuff. And they had beautiful uh, dinnerware there with sunflower and all the stuff for the kitchen and everything. They had completely sold out. And I mean, I checked in July and they had sold out already. I'm like, you're kidding me. I didn't even know it would be out that early. So I've checked back several times and they're like, it's came twice, we're not gonna get any back. So our Dollar Tree is about a 30 minute drive from where I live, but we're gonna be getting a new one in soon here locally. So guess what? I'll be having a new hangout place because if I don't go by there, I'll be sending my husband to go by there. Because honestly, their dinnerware stuff is awesome and their glassware, uh, they have beautiful chargers. They have a lot of really nice decor stuff. So don't think that Dollar Tree doesn't, doesn't uh, have some nice things because they really do. But anyway, last year I done my um, tablescape for fall uh, and Thanksgiving with the black and white buffalo plaid check. And I loved it, but I sort of thought I'd mix it up this year. I've still not decided because I did really want to do the sunflower, but I've not been able to find it. And I don't want to pay full price for like 10 or $12 for a plate. I'm just not going to do that. But anyway, I um, did find something that I liked at Hobby Lobby. I may use this one, I may not, because I can still use the decor even if I don't do my tablescape in this. So the inspiration for this tablescape came from this picture. Let me show you. This here, hope you can see it good. I love it. I love all the different picture colors of the pumpkins. I think those are just so pretty and I just think it's beautiful. I love it. I love the green and the cream color. I just think it's so pretty. But anyway, this was my inspiration. So anyway, let me show you some of the stuff that I picked out. And let me get my glasses so I can see. Okay. And all of their fall stuff is 40% off right now. So if you do shop, I, I mean, I saved a lot from what I got. These are the chargers that I picked out. They are like that green, not mint green, not teal. I don't know what you call it, but they're beautiful. I love them. Look at that, how pretty. Like it's so pretty. These were, let's see, these were regular $3.99 and they were 40% off. So not very much at all. I love it. Then look at this. This is the plate. Just look how pretty that is gonna to look together. I think it's gorgeous. And these were $9.99 and they were 40% off, so $6. That ain't too bad, but I think they're beautiful. I love this green and cream color together and like the, um, the turquoise blue color. I think that's just so pretty. And I mean, I, think, I just think that looks so pretty together. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Okay. And then, let me show you what else. I got this pumpkin, which is that sagey green color that I thought would be really pretty as a centerpiece. And then I got this cream color or white that I just think is gorgeous. Isn't it pretty? It's a little bit smaller. And then I got this color, 
that is like almost that creamy yellowy buttery color and these are all three different sizes so i think those would look real pretty in a centerpiece part of a centerpiece but i don't know if i'm going to use it but that's the idea that i'm getting right now the vibe i'm getting we'll see these were great prices um keep reaching for my glasses this one was $13.99 and it was 40% off. This one was $6.99. That was 40% off after that. And this one is $24.99 and it was 40% off. I just think those are beautiful. Okay. I got this color forks to put with it. See how it's got like that rust color or coppery color? And the stem and the leaf. I love that. I love to um, pick flatware to match. I just think it's beautiful. Even if they're plastic and disposable, I think it's beautiful. I'll make a beautiful place setting. Okay. I like to get my dining room and this formal sitting room. I call it formal. It's not really formal. We just never sit in here. It's not really comfortable furniture. It was just something to put in here. Um, my dining room, kitchen, and my sitting room, I like for those all three to sort of coordinate the colors. So I got this towel for the kitchen, which I think will be really pretty. And this one was $6.99, so 40% off of that. All right, then I went to Marshall's and well, let's see what I've got in here. I forgot I've got something else. I oh, forgot that's the place. All right. I went to Marshall's and they had this throw pillow, which I think will match perfect. And I'm gonna put it in my sitting room. I think it'll be so pretty on this couch. And it was $19.99, but I think it's so pretty. It is it's big and it's soft. It's made really well. Isn't that beautiful? That's so pretty. And then they had this pumpkin, which I loved because it's that same turquoise teal color. I thought it would be pretty to put somewhere. And that was, let's see, um, that was $7.99, that pumpkin was. And then I found this one and I thought it was pretty too. It's like the teal color and it's like glazed and it was $9.99. Isn't that pretty? It's more elegant looking. I thought that was so pretty. All right. I found this for my sitting room. I think I'm gonna put that on my mantelpiece, the uh, mantle in my sitting room. I think that's gorgeous. It's got like, white my fireplace in here is white and um i think that'll look really pretty on it's got the pine cones and the wheat grass and i've got a lot of stuff i'm going to incorporate with it i think it's so pretty and then i got this acorn at hobby lobby it was 8.99 and 40 percent off that and it's rather large i think that'll look really pretty on the mantle too somewhere and I found this beautiful garland. Let me stretch it out here. I like garland on the fireplace. Let me know if you all like to put garland on your fireplace. I think it's so pretty on your mantle, I mean. Um, let me figure it out here. It's tangled up. Look how pretty this is. Isn't that gorgeous? I don't know if you can tell it or not. Isn't that pretty? It's got like the burlap leaves and then the gold leaves. Look how pretty that is. And it's hanging with clothespins, so it's classy, but yet still uh, really uh, more traditional and cozy with the burlap and the pine cones and the uh, clothespin clips. I think that's so cute. I love it. All right, now, if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen this, but if you don't, try to go over and check out my Instagram. I'd love for you to follow me on there. Um, 
my name is uh, Vicki Renee Wright on Instagram. V-I-C-K-I-E-R-E-N-E-E-W-R-I-G-H-T. I got these and I'm obsessed. A uh, girl I follow on YouTube, Leslie from A Charming Abode, she showed these one time and I loved them. They're little miniature charcuterie boards. I think, and they were only $3.99 and then they were 40% off. These were one of the things I wanted they didn't have and I went back and they had got more in stock, so I loved that. Loved that. Um, I think these would be so cute to use like on a play setting, like if you're gonna have a Christmas dinner or even Thanksgiving, if you wanna do a couple or three hors d'oeuvres on it. Like I made one the other day for my granddaughter because we love charcuterie and my son and his wife, they make charcuterie boards all the time. And you can do anything as fancy as you want it or as simple as you want. You can do hot dogs and hamburgers with the fixings on it. You can do pancakes with uh, all the fixings and toppings on it. You can do, um, like I said, it's unlimited, a s'mores buffet or anything. But I put her some little um, cheese cubes and crackers, goldfish crackers, and uh, some little beef sticks cut up and a few grapes, and she loved it. So those were so cute. But I think this would be neat for a Valentine's dinner. A lot of times on Valentine's Day, my husband and I eat at home because the crowds are just so crazy to eat out. We will either go before Valentine's or after Valentine's and eat. But usually on Valentine's Day, I cook at home. I think that would be so cute to have our play setting and have a few little tiny appetizers on this. I think that would be so cute. Let me know what you all would do with it. I think you could also, someone said that they would use it like maybe as a riser or put it on a tear tray. And I think that would be really cute too. Okay, and I got a splinter bad in the store that day, so be careful with those. Okay, this is one of my other favorite things that I got. This little individual cake stand, I call it like a cupcake stand. Oh my gosh, it was $2.99 and it was 40% off. These are adorable. I think that these would be so cute to put, like I said, on a Valentine's dinner if you done like a red velvet cupcake and put it on top of this and put it at your play setting, or you could do some chocolate covered strawberries and sit on here. You could do different types of desserts, but it would have to be something small. You could make some uh, truffles and put on here or even buy some truffles and put on here like after dinner truffles. Uh, I know Lindor makes some really good truffles. You could put a variety of those on there and put them at the play setting. Um, also, you could use these as a riser. I think these would look so cute with a miniature pumpkin. I was trying to look. I, was, I thought I had something else, but I don't know. Let's look here if it's in here or not. But I think it would look so cute with a little miniature pumpkin on it. I don't see it in here. But just set a little pumpkin here. Or even to take these and use these risers on your play settings. Whoops. I think it would definitely stay. It's not heavy. It's just where, my, where I'm sitting like this. Look. And it would lift it up and elevate it. I think that would be so cute. So you could use these on tear trays for that. You could use them on any table or buffet for that. You could, like I said, use it for a cupcake stand. I just think they're adorable. I think they're so cute. I'm obsessed with them. Okay. This is another thing I got that I thought was so pretty. This is the um, name cards or place cards. But you know what? There are little pumpkins that you can write on here and then you can take it off and then reuse it. I think you could use it as a napkin ring too. So I may do that. I think I would put my napkin through here and then write the name of the person that's eating at that place setting there and sit it somewhere on the place setting. And I think that would be adorable but you could do it with or without the napkin, but it's got a place that I think a napkin would fit. I'm gonna try and see what it looks like. I mean, you don't have anything to lose if you don't. Isn't that so cute though? But that is my um, haul from Hobby Lobby. I will show you a few things that I got from the Dollar Tree. I didn't get a whole lot, but I got several of what I got. And I'll show you that. They had some really cute things for tear trays. 
the, you know, like I said, they're all a dollar. I thought these are cute. I don't know if I use them, but I picked them up anyway. This little thing here, isn't that cute? It says, Happy Fall. So cute. And then this one says, Autumn Blessing. I thought that was precious. And this one here says, Gather with Grateful Hearts. I just think that's so cute. And I love the tear trays. Do you all still like the tear trays? Do you think that's a thing or are you over the tear trays? Let me know in the comments below. Okay. Look how adorable. These little miniature hay bales. I thought those would be cute to even use as a place setting. You could put that on there and put just a small pumpkin on it. I think would be really cute. Or you could use them as part of your centerpiece as risers. You could do that. But you could sit them on your tear trays. You could sit them around your house anywhere you wanted to add decor. I think that would be beautiful. So I got some of these. I knew those would go fast. And then I picked up some of these. I don't know if I'll use them. They're just little orange glitter pumpkins. Um, it says decorative filler. I think those would be cute on a tear tray as well. And just scatter them about. Excuse me. Scatter them about. All right. I found this sign here. That says grateful. I thought that was really cute. I love the tear trays. Still. Even if they're out of style. I'm usually a day late and a dollar short. But I like it. And then I got... Um, this little cute ceramic pumpkin, which I thought is really cute. It's got a little metal leaf on the top of it. Isn't that adorable? The Dollar Tree people, I'm telling you, they, they've got it all together. They've got these cute little picks in there for a dollar. I thought these would even be cute to use as a part of your napkin holder or napkin ring. I think you could fold it a certain way and then put one of these picks down in it. That would look cute. But you could use these for a lot of things. You could use it as filler in your centerpiece. But they had these in different types. I got this kind. I got this one here. This has got some berries and pine cones and an apple on it or pomegranate or something. I thought that was cute. And then I got, um, let's see here. This one here. Got a little pumpkin, some leaves, and some little berries on it. That might have been the only ones I got. Yeah, that's another one like I had. Okay. And then I also found there um, the little miniature lights. I've got a couple of the grapevine trees that I decorate sometimes for holidays, especially for fall I use them. And I think these would look so cute on it. These are orange, and it's five feet long, so it's perfect for that. And I seem like I only picked up one. I hope I picked up two because I have two of them. And I usually put them on either side of my fireplace in my family room. But I've not decided what colors I'm going to do yet. You all help me decide. I don't know. Comment below. Do you think I should do the buffalo check in my dining room? Or should I do this new color, the sage and the cream and the teal? I love both of them. And then I've got the traditional colors, too, that I could do in the sitting room. So, I'm not, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Let's see here. Is that it? And then I thought I picked up some thank you cards also. But that's my fall haul. And I uh, thank you for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this. If you would like to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to uh, do that if you think that's something you would enjoy. And I hope you have a great day. God bless you and see you soon. Bye.